On, ladies and gentlemen, it's Joe here, December 12th, 2021, 12.04 a.m. here in Minnesota. Uh, we're just doing a quick little update on the spots that are going to be coming up around, I'll say, the next three to four days. They should be facing us within the next six, maybe. Uh, don't quote me on that, though. Uh, but we're going to go take a look at some couple of things. We're going to look at SDO, SoHo. Give you guys a little update. Sunspot numbers, you can see, is zero here. Right there. New region is zero. We're going to go up. As you can see, we got this little area right here. Uh, right in that area. That's going to be coming around. And we're going to take a closer look at that, actually, on the... Show you guys what that looks like now. And nothing good right now. I mean, does that look good? No. Um, these ones are a little bit worrisome just because of how big it is. We didn't have one this big when we had the X-Flare hit us on October 28th. Uh, actually, you can go check out a previous video I did on that. Uh, just a lot going on right now. I'm getting also reports just watching, um, the situation in Kentucky and Illinois and, uh, Tennessee, uh, Missouri, Arkansas. Uh, it was about 70 people confirmed dead, I believe now. Uh, an F4 tornado ripped through like 250 miles worth of land, towns. Mayfield, Kentucky was a big hit from that one. Uh, so, mind with me if I'm a little bit slow right now. I'm watching other stuff on the side on my other phone. Uh, but, we're going to go to SDO here. I'm going to take a look at that. Looks like we had almost a C flare that could be from the region off to the right there. I mean, it's getting more and more... Really don't want to know what this looks like. We're going to go look at uh, 94 Angstroms. Camera's going to start being funky probably. Alright, we're loading here. You can start to see that action there down at that. Camera's being slow. What is that happening before it happens? You see that little flash? Hmm. Weird. And that's as far as it goes right there. That's as far as we can see right now. We're going to go take a look at 171 angstroms. Start to see the arcs. Arcs of energy coming around there. Looks like we have a little CME there as well. Man. <laughs> we'll take a look at 193 angstroms. Come on, stop being funky. Let's go. There we go. Yeah. Lots of energy down there. Lots of it. This is going to be a big one. I'm calling it right now. Uh, you can quote me on this one. Something big is going to come from this one. This one is looking like forget what the number was but it was up there on that top left corner here you're going to be able to see all that you see that shooting out there look at that we'll rewind that a little bit right there right there I mean, 
That is a bad spot. And we are able to almost see it. Look for an uptick in earthquake activity and volcanic activity in the next week. Take a look at 335 angstrom. She is ready to rumble, folks. Down there in that lower left corner. <clears throat> As you can see, nothing on the magnetogram. But look at stereo A. And take a see if we can get a, a look here. If it'll want to load it up. And of course it don't. So we're going to do this. Alright, we were able to get a, get into there. We're going to go down to the most recent one. And this is what's coming. Look how long it is. And you also have that spot right there. What is this? Excuse me? Does somebody want to tell me what that is? So I don't know. Let's see if there's any more. It looks like we got a little something over here too. What do we got going on here? And one here. Yeah, I don't know. There's also one up there. Can't quite see it because it's not as close to the sun, so you can't see it. But these ones... Man, and it looks like that one is like shooting something at the sun. Yeah, I don't know. I, I don't know what to make of those. Uh, yeah. I don't know. <laughs> I ain't never seen anything like that. Let's go look at the end little spiral graph. See if we've had any. We had a little mini shot right there. And that would have been facing. That would have been on the spot that's coming at us. So it's probably getting ready for a big one here pretty soon. Yeah, everything is all in quiet right now, but oh, just wait a couple, couple days, give or take four to five. That'll be facing us. See if we got anything interesting on Soho. Little camera glitch. can see a little bit coming out of there. Hmm. I know you guys saw that. Right here. Jim. I don't know. Hmm. I wonder if we'll be able to see that on Lasco C3. This is kind of turning into a bit of a UFO video, maybe? Stuff aimed at our sun? This might be a little bit of a longer video because I'm going to take some looks here. <laughs> yeah, look at that. Watch right in this area. You see this thing still shoot right towards our sun. I don't know. 
<laughs> I don't know what to make of that. Right there. Notice how everything is moving left to right. And this thing just shoots at the sun. Right there. Boom. Then you'll notice there's like a little explosion that happens right as it enters the, the sun's atmosphere there. Watch that upper left corner. Right as it goes into the sun. Right about now. Hmm. <laughs> we got some interesting things happening up there. It's kind of turning into a little bit of a different video other than a sun update. Hey. I gotta show you guys what I see on here. And what I see are some weird things. We're gonna go take a look at that one more time, actually. I mean, still. That looks very strange. I mean, it's the fact that there's multiples. Because you got one down here. And then right there. And then this one you can't see because it's farther away. But that. I wonder if it's in the one before it. So this is the video previous. This is the previous snapshot. And these things are right there. Down here. Right here. And right here. Hmm. Four of them. Wonder if it's in the one before that. Where are they? So we got. Can kind of make it out right there. It's just the one that I see here. Look at this picture here. Looks like we got one there, and there, one a little bit closer to the sun, a few right there, what, what is this, what is going on up there, alright, we're going to go back to the, yeah, enough of the weird, I'll let you guys decide on what those are but to me those look rather peculiar so we're going to end it off on just taking another look at what's coming give you guys a little brief update on what i think is going to happen now just based on what i have seen previous there could be a possibility for an x flare coming from this I mean, this spot is huge. I mean, this is massive, like, extremely massive. There's going to be M flares, high M flares, maybe borderline X. I do believe we are going to get an X flare, though, directly at us again, just like on October 8th. Or October 28th, sorry. Uh, go check out that video. That'll have some information on what happens after that. We had the KP index at 7. Uh, Northern Lights were extreme across the United States. But we're going to end this off here with just a look. Let you guys look at what's coming. Um, just want to again, uh, thoughts and prayers out to everyone affected by the tornado outbreak um seeing all the videos all the pictures of the damage and everything is a lot of people's lives were changed last night so thoughts and prayers out all to you and stay safe guys remember leave a like and subscribe share this to keep everyone up to date on what's going on up there and i'll keep you guys up to date take care